All right, let's do the question number 51. So, uh, 51, we're supposed to calculate the concentration of OH minus and get the pH of the solution mixture of the 0.2 molar NH3 and then NH4 plus, right? That's basically the NH4 plus. So, what I need to have right now is to get the table values. So ammonia is, uh, what is ammonia? Ammonium ion, oh yeah, like that. You can actually get the uh, pKa value, that's a conjugate acid, and that's a 9.25. So conjugate base is actually the, the, uh, 14 minus this value, right? So it's 4.75. So you get these things from the, the uh, table and then you get 0 0.2 and 0 0.1 from the, the uh, problem. Now, what you need to do is to figure out which one is a B, which one is a, the, uh, HB, or the, which one is HA, and then which one is A minus. Obviously, this is HA, and then this is A minus, or the, the, um, this is B, and then this is HB, right? Then you can actually use any one of these formula to actually calculate the, uh, the things here. So let's just start calculating the pOH uh, using the, um, the very last formula right here, so which is the um, pKb that plus log of the HB is HB concentration is 0 0.1 divided by B. So you can actually get that. And once you get that, pH is equal to 14 minus that. So you can get, get it that way. And also the OH concentration. Oops. OH minus concentration is actually given by 10 to the power of negative that one. Right? So you get that. The, um, you can also get the pH uh, using the very fast formula. It's equal to pKa plus the log of A minus divided by HA. And that number and that number is the same. And then that the um, H concentration of um, the uh, POH. Well, actually, should I actually do this one? The H concentration. H plus concentration is equal to 10 to the power of negative this one. Right? And then the OH minus concentration is equal to 10 to the negative 14 divide by that shit oops ten to the negative fourteen divide by why do I actually have missing negative ten to the negative fourteen divide by that you get the same number. So yeah e either way which formula you you choose to use um it doesn't matter. Y you wanna come up with the same numbers. And uh some other stuff that I should probably mention here is that I use a concentration right here but because the these two chemicals they are both in the same liquid that means that the volume of the solution is is same so you can actually use log of concentration divided by concentration but because concentration is equal to the number of mole divided by mole, you can actually use, see that the volume is gonna cancel because they're using the same, same volume. So you can actually use the number of mole divided by number of mole. So yeah, you can actually use the, the number of mole of A minus, a number of mole of HA, a number of mole of, mole of B and number of mole of the HB plus. As long as 
the unit is going to cancel. You can use whichever. The my recommendation is usually uh, use as a number of number of model, number of mini model. Um, that's usually the, the better choice to actually solve these type of problems.